Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem 16 in chapter 4. Uh, in this one, we will still do the Newton's second law. We can see we have the, a particle and it is put on the elevator and the particle's mass is given. And in this one, we see it tells us the magnitude of the acceleration. Uh, in unit g, this g is acceleration due to gravity, 9.8 meter per second square. Ask you the maximum and minimum force. So the first thing for this one, I strongly suggest you to draw a picture, see what happens on this uh, particle. In this one, we can see, first thing, the force acts on the particle, gravity, and then the tension, right? The force on the tension, so this elevator, the force, tension. And in this one, we can see because this problem only tells us the magnitude of the acceleration. That means the acceleration can be up. So this, in this case, acceleration is up. And the acceleration can be down. So there, when the acceleration pointing down, that we just need to add the not negative sign there. The next thing, we can apply Newton's second law. For Newton's second law, we can see the net force equals the mass times acceleration. So tension minus gravity equals mass times acceleration. In this there, the acceleration can be this positive, can be negative. In this way, we can get the force maximum and the minimum. See? In this one, we consider the Newton's second law, we get the force can be just uh, hmm, positive and uh, this force can be mass equals acceleration plus the gravity g this one and also this one we can also consider the acceleration is negative and make it input in the newton second law and get the final answer thank you